Howdy y'all, my name is Price and welcome back to some more Epic Chef! Last time, oh man, a whole bunch of stuff happened. League of uh, Critics or something, whatever they were, showed up. Uh, things are changing y'all. There's like a whole conspiracy or something going on. Uh, Illuminati up in here, okay. So, here we go, talking to Mitriel. So, I'm ready? Looks like you are. You only need to talk to Bosco at the Kilinarum stand and he'll set you all into motion. Everything else depends on you. Neat! Any final advice? Make sure you bring a lot of high quality ingredients and plan ahead. I can tell you that it will be a three dish contest. If I know Tarapio, he'll cook very vigorous dishes. I wouldn't try beating him in this field. What then? Should I focus on more elaborate dishes? Yes, you should have a sauce ready that goes well with sophisticated dishes. Tarapio won't be able to benefit from that and you'll be able to impress the judge. Keep that in mind when you're preparing. Got it. Good luck then. And remember, do not mention my name or my help or they will disqualify you. This is very against the rules. Okay. All right, so we do need to prepare some more stuff. Sounds like the ghost tato will be very useful. Let's let's see. Um let's unequip it. Um, so that one's got a ton. I won't be getting red. I wonder if there's a sauce that will cancel out red. Because if there is, that might be more beneficial than doing the yellow sauce that boosts the yellow. I could use those kinds of things just for my, um, leveling up. Uh, anyway, we gotta head all the way home. I actually think I should just do, like, one of these... A, I mean, I forget what happens if you're out too late. Does it just take you home or do you get like a negative? I don't want to potentially get a negative. Oh, and there's stuff in his saddlebags, huh? I should check that. Um, so I need to talk to them, but first I need to start um, planning out what we're going to do. So I want to look at the mixer and um, see all the stuff I can make there. I want to see about the sauce maker, see what we can make there. Um, so let's go ahead and go to bed. Do, 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 do. And um, in the morning, we're going to get started on that stuff. We're going to get started on sauces. We're going to make two more ghost tatoes, I think. We're going to look and see if there's other stuff that we want to make, if we can make it. Um, so, yeah. Let's go to bed. Sleep in. Y'all, it's been fun coming back to this game. I got to be honest. I was concerned coming back to it because, honestly, the... Uh, the mechanic of baking or making stuff, cooking stuff, um, it really stresses me out. It's just really intense. Um, okay, so we got to make all these dishes live, right? So I'm going to have to be able to do this on the go. I may want to practice it. Um, okay, sauces. Plus 10 vigor flavor, so we don't want that. Makes the judge hate spirit. Makes the judge like sophistication, so cheeso sauce is good. Plus 10 spirit flavors. Plus 10 uh, satisfaction and plus 20 spirit. Ah, okay. Well, the best thing we're going to be able to make is going to be this thing. So that takes special dough and rice bechamel. Well, we can make that stuff here. So, um, oh, can we make the bechamel? Special dough. Crap, we can't make the bechamel. How do we make the bechamel? Is that over here? Must be this thing. Mushroom sauce, no. Carabera, basic tomato, special cream, spirit potato sauce. Hmm. This is interesting. Oh, we can't make the ethereal katsubushi. Um, okay. Oh, that's the rice bechamel. What's the stuff I don't have? Oh, I, it's rice bechamel and the dough. Okay, okay. That's it. That's what I need. I don't know why I was confused. Um, or I mean, I know why, because I just don't pay attention. So, we can make two of those. What do we need for the dough? This will be good. This, you know, I'm going to use this chest over here for this stuff. That's what it's going to be. Okay. You, we need rice and carrots. We need a lot of rice, y'all. Okay. Luckily, I think we have a lot of rice. Um, let's go grab a mandragora. We're definitely going to need those. Still only two cows. How are we doing on feed? Doing just fine. Okay. So, so far, still two. Again, we'll give it a couple days. We'll see what happens. Um, let's grab, I think it was carrots and rice. So, we're going to do this. I'm going to see how many of these I need to reseed. There's one carrot spot that needs to be redone. 
Um, one potato spot that needs to be done. Let me check my inventory. Oh, it's full. Absolutely full. Okay. So let's go start making some of this stuff. What can I get rid of? Apples. Let's get rid of all these apples. Don't need them. Don't need them. Boom. And then meat chest. We will also put milk in there. Um, just kind of makes sense to put them in the same spot. Face Terapio in combat. Yeah, we got it. We got to prepare for this. We may not do that this episode, to be honest. Um, okay. Oh, that's what I wanted to put in here. Special uh, ghost tato. We're going to arrange all of our stuff here. So once I have it all laid out, I can know that I have everything that I want. I might even... Well, we won't do backups because that's overboard. And, um, you know, we'll just come back and get stuff if we have to. Uh, okay, so the dough, we need, um, I think, three. Because we might need to make a bunch of this sauce, right? So this guy needs one special dough. One... Oh, I need the milk. How many of these should I make? That's the question. Probably three. So I can use one each turn. Um, if it lets me. I don't remember if it lets me do multiple sauces in a row. I'm curious, actually. Um, milk. Milk is what I needed. But I, yeah, I think I should make three. Um, one, two, three. I think I have enough carrots. I probably have enough rice. We'll see. I might need more carrots for the bechamel. I can't remember. But yeah, I like the idea of making three. Milk and rice. One, two, three. Okay. And then over here, we make the dough. What was the dough again? Rice and carrots. All right, we need... Two more rice, which we should have in the um, in the rice chest, and then that'll give us our three. So that'll be awesome. Um, do 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 do. Grabbing just as much as we need. Uh, okay. Put you in here. There we go. Back over to the sauce machine, and we're making some cheese queso or cheeso, whatever. Okay. Increase sophistication points in subsequent dishes by times two. Effect for two dishes. Okay. So, I want at least two so I can do it also on the last turn. Um, it's interesting because you use the aroma to try and balance these, right? Because if I use it on turn one, it lasts for that turn and it lasts for his turn. And then... If I do the aroma thing, I can skip him and do it again so that he doesn't get the benefit, but he'll get the benefit on the next turn, and then I won't get it on the last turn unless I use it a third time. I, it's interesting. I, I think I might just want to use it every time and try and get either no aroma or top aroma. Um, either way, I think it would work. That's an interesting, an interesting uh, question. Here all this wood. Okay. Cheezo is going in here. Boop, boop, boop. Um, what else do we want? I'm just trying to think if like any of this stuff would be good to try and incorporate. Um, does any of this add yellow? This one adds a lot of yellow. Mandragore. Oh, that's the ghost tato. <laughs> um, the ground beef does too. Milk and cow meat it doesn't co oh it does a lot of red too though which it's kind of like we don't necessarily want that and it doesn't combo with anything that we have i don't think i do think we have some stuff that combos with um that machine animal thing properties none of them it's not rice right it's machine plant Gonna need some more milk. Um, okay. I know there's something. This one. So apples would go well with the ground beef. Um, but that might be not enough to justify it. But ghost tatoes, definitely. So you throw the rice in, you do the ghost tato, and then rice allows you to use potato, I think? Or tomato. Probably tomato. Yeah. Or we could look for something better. We could look for something better than that. A carrot is better than that. Um, so, mandragoras. How are we doing here? Do we just have the one? We think we just have the one. 
So we're going to try and save those up. I would like to make seeds. It's going to take us a bit longer um, to get this stuff going. But in between then, I can uh, do a little bit of um, planting, a little bit of chopping down. None of these guys produced apples because I didn't let them be alive long enough. So we're going to let those ones go a little bit longer. Um, I don't think there's anything else that I need to... Um, do quest wise so i should do or look at some of my side quest stuff i should go see um uh the lady down at the uh docks right um because it's been a while what else where else have i not been oh let's you know what let's look at the sides right old couple hadriv scraba yeah and that's it, but, like, there's also little quests around, like, where I can, like, you know, um, sell goods, right? Yeah, I do not want to do that yet. We need a lot more stuff. It's mostly the mandragoras that we're going to have to wait on, which is why I want to get more seeds in place. Because otherwise, we're eventually going to run out for long term. Let's talk to uh, Jesus here and see uh, if he's got anything that we need. Hey, Jesus. Hey, Zess. Need anything? May I browse your regular wares? Of course. Take a good look. Oh, we got a lot of stuff. Okay. Slaughterhouse, low fence, scarecrow, green floor, decorative plant, and a decorative plant too. And then fences. Are these... These are recipes, right? Yeah, because it's like the recipe for the slaughterhouse. So it's not like I'm buying this. I'm buying the recipe for the fence. Um, cost 200, plant 200, that 200. You know what? Oh, I only have 200 on me. We'll come back later. What else do we have here? Oh, is there a better bed? Tell me about the bed, man. Can I buy the chair? Okay. It's got that exclamation, but it's like it doesn't let me ask him about it. Okay, we'll be back when we have money. I would like to buy some of those things just, you know, to have them. What's in my inventory? Nothing to sell. Let's go to Scrabba's. I feel like I've never been there after we did the quest. Maybe I have been. Do you have a thing? Oh, you know what? This is just his energy. That's not the saddlebags. Let's um, give him... What's a low one? That one. Nice. Oh, resistance up. That feels like that's new. Interesting. I'm sure they've, they've had a couple of updates since the last time I played, so that'll be interesting to see kind of how that's changed things. Oh, maybe you have to come here at night. Hmm. Yeah, maybe we have to come here at night. Okay. We will try to remember to do that. Well, let's run around and maybe grab some stuff on the beach. We got crabbies. I don't think I can, like... Yeah, I can't go into the water. Fishing. I am still curious about fishing. Like, maybe I can do the fishing quest. Or maybe I can do fishing, like, on the beach over there. Where I think you can pull out a fishing rod. And maybe if I let it do it for long enough, maybe I will catch fish. We will see. Ooh, what can we do with this guy? Do we have anything that we can give to him now? Hmm, you here to make a shipment? Not really. I was looking for a job. Aha, uh -huh. check the schedules of parting the shipments board. We need to supply a lot of people. So we'll buy anything you bring. Fixed price, though. No haggling. Anything I bring? Oh, any of these things. Weekly shipment schedule. Five special dough. I could do that. Uh, five serimi, pink dough, pangan ghost, breaded spider leg, ethereal katsuboshi. Um... Special dough. Is that... Because it says a special, which is, you know, a different language. So it's the only thing is I'm, I'm concerned that it's not just regular special dough like I have made. That it's maybe, um... Like another upgrade to one, because then there was like pink dough or something. So I'm worried that like, that might not be the right one. So we will see. Haven't been back there in a while, but I don't think we need to. Oh, I, th I thought I could go around that way. Okay, we are going to go... Oh, there's a fishing shop right here. Nope, nothing. Um, okay. So yeah, let's go to the beach. Like I had said, we'll see um, if the fishing thing works. Because I would like to try it. Um, and like I said, you know, we're kind of waiting on the mandragoras right now. Um, I'll be able to pick another one at night, I think, because it's like two a day, it seemed. Um, oh yeah, that one's not fishing, it's swimming. Now that I think about it. Um, we're getting lots of crabs, lots of seaweed, right? 
Oh yeah, tons of inventory space. So I mean, it's not a, a total wash here, but um, yeah, I, for some reason I thought that there was a fishing spot out here. Is there one at my at my home? There's the golf one at home. Maybe we just have to get like a fishing net or something eventually. I'm intrigued. Or maybe there's one over here that I haven't seen. We'll find out. I'm, I'm sure that they would tell me in the game when I would be able to. Okay. Continuing to move forward. So let's think... While we're doing this, what other things can we do? Let's go talk to Hadriv. See if there's anything going on there. We're going to go to Scrabba's at night, is the thing. That's what we're going to try and do. So while we're waiting on it, let's go check in with Hadra, uh, Hadriv, and let's go check in with the uh, the older couple. We've had some story things happen, so there may be some movements on this. We're pretty hungry over here. If you have any vigorous dishes, we'll be happy to take them off your hands for a handsome sum. Let's see. Vigor, vigor. Ooh, we got some good ones. Let's give him this one. Why not? Apple, tomato, rat. That's an easy one to make. Obviously, skill matters. Ah, food! That's great! The boys are starving. Thank you, Zest. That hit the spot. Here's your payment. Nice! Good money on that. Good, good money on that. This guy... That's right. Ten pieces of seaweed. Let's go talk to this couple over here, if time doesn't run out. I think that they just do that. The doctors. Um, care to take a seat and have an educated chat? Sure. Sure thing. That'd be nice. Cute. Yeah, okay. So they don't do one. Who else is it that has a repeatable feed quest? I feel like there's another one. Maybe I'm wrong, though. Maybe I'm just thinking of the tomato guy. Okay. Birch, let's get headed down to Scrabba's, because it's going to be nightfall very soon. Very, very soon. Who are you? Are you Scrabba? No, you are not Scrabba. Do, do, do. Oh, hey! Look who's open at this point. What's up, Scrabs? Hello, Zest. Doing fine? I'm all right. Happy to see you managed to reopen this place. Your little intervention helped. Thank heavens you remembered it right. What do you need? Hello, Zest. Okay. Okay, I guess that's it. Nothing for Scrabba yet. All right, what's up here? Anything? It's 7 p.m., so it's already nighttime, right? Yeah. Hmm. So I guess nothing yet. It's interesting because she's got the exclamation point. I'm not sure what that means then. I feel like that means that you should have like a quest or something from them. What is with that? What is this? How have I never come back here? What is this? Can I talk to anyone here? What's up? You. Test your strength! Want to test your strength, mister? There's a magnificent reward for you if you hit the ball. A reward, eh? Maybe I will. How much is it? For you? Nothing. Nothing? You know that Zest guy, Spec says, has moved into the villa. I respect that kind of courage. Letting you play my game for free is my way to pay you my respects. Ah, well, thank you. You're welcome. Name's Grack. Take the hammer and give it a go. May I use my own hammer? A connoisseur, eh? Be my guest. Well, let's do this, then. Okay. Strength challenge. Nice! I did it! Holy Tusker! You did it! You earned the prize! Great! What is it? A magnificent hat! Here! Oh, cool! Is this a dwarven helmet? Yes, it is! From my hometown! You're a bit tall for a dwarf. Not a dwarf by race, but by culture. Had to leave the mines, though. Loved it in there, but it was a constant struggle. It always felt like I had to choose between back pain and a headache. Makes sense. But you've chosen the least dwarven destination in all of Folger. Haven't seen a single one around. Yeah, I know. Not big fans of the warm weather. Supply caravans show up regularly, though. You know, things like heavy industry materials or local franchises of the Gibshi Emporium. In any case, thank you, Grack. You're welcome. Come back and try again whenever you want. Neat! Okay. What is this? Shoot the critic. Play. Oh, okay. Got him. Nice! Cost you 100, you get 200. Okay. Is there anything else I can do over here? Like, I want to know what this is. This wheel. I want to talk to you. But it won't let me. 
Okay. I guess that's all we can do over here. Nothing we can, no, nothing we can do with those guys. Oh man, I'd love it if I could play whatever this wheel is. There's no, no handles on the side. I just want to make sure. Okay. And that tree, man. How awesome is that? That's so great. I love this. Oh, look at the shark guy. All right, I'm going to wait a second until he does that again. Because, yeah, that's a, that's a thumbnail if I ever saw one. Do, 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 do. Hold on. we got to get a real good shot of this, you know? All right, anyway. <laughs> uh, all right. Let us move on. Okay, well, you know what? We're probably coming up on the end of the episode anyways. Um, like I said, uh, we're still working on the ingredients for our Terapio battle. I'm going to go try and make sure I get back in time to grab another uh, Mandragora. And then I think it's too late for us to do another um, another leveling thing. So the Mandragora is the important thing anyways. Okay, dropping down, grabbing that. Let's grab y'all's milk. Still only two, so I am really starting to believe that uh, they don't breed. Um, and that's okay. That's okay. We will just have to clone them every time. It's interesting. It's like you really have to pay for those ingredients. So it's like it wants to make sure that you like, I guess, don't have too much meat. Like that, you have to be very kind of thoughtful with it, or at least early on. Um, can we make? I do not have two potatoes on me. Well, that's fine, because we're about to run out of time. If I can, I would love to get in one of these. Got it. No, wrong one. Dang it, I meant to do this one. Let's change clothes first. Oh, that's right. Well, it's bedtime. I don't want to mess with it. Okay. Well, y'all, I'm going to go ahead and start saying our goodbyes. Y'all, uh, thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. I know a lot of y'all been looking forward to some epic chef, and uh, I'm glad to finally be able to bring it to you. Um, but y'all, with that, thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. If you did, please leave a like, uh, leave a comment down below. Both of those things help tremendously. But most importantly, y'all, have a wonderful rest of your day. My name is Ben Price, and I will see y'all next time.